Welcome to Compliance Mate, the most comprehensive management solution designed for back of the house monitoring for restaurants and food service operations. Compliance Mate focus is to provide real time monitoring of equipment and standard operating procedures within a restaurant. This includes remote temperature monitoring of coolers and equipment, HACCP control, real time reporting of list completion, and improved store management using today's technology, incorporating friendly, easy to use graphics to interface with the user. Team members can quickly and efficiently work through a variety of checks they conduct on a daily basis, gathering all the data as required by corporate policy in a digital timestamp format. This data is transmitted via the internet to a secure site where it can be reviewed real time anywhere in the world via a web enabled device. Missed checks and anomalies in the data can trigger various alerts from store level up to corporate level to promote compliance. Compliance Mate's cooler monitoring utilizes the latest in wireless technology to provide a continuous and real time understanding of cooler performance and alerts when equipment operation is not within specification. The Compliance Mate system is specifically intended for back of the house operations. We automate your concept's food safety processes to provide necessary data capture, ensuring tasks are completed to your brand's requirements. Our system is highly configurable and flexible. You tell us how you want the system to work for your operation. The ROI calculation for the Compliance Mate system begins with the overall management gains, optimized equipment performance, accountability, and overall protection of your brand. These are our customers. Let's hear what some of them have to say. It is easy. I mean, it, it, it's for, for someone to walk around and be able to hit one button and I hit another button, hit another button, another button. And, uh, you know, they, they should already know how to take temperatures of products. I think we, you know, we make sure we got people that can do that at least. Um, but, it, you know, it can be handed to any individual. It doesn't even have to be a manager. It can be handed down to a, you know, to a line employee that can handle it because in the sense, it's very easy to read. It flows very well. Um, and like I said, the system does, you know, it's simple as pushing a couple buttons and stuff like that. Um, and then on top of that, added in the extra part about the uh, automated sensors. Um, that takes a, you know, a whole bunch of time out of, out of uh, you know, gives back a whole bunch of time to the managers where they don't have to go in and tempt the equipment anymore. Um, or don't have to take the invalid reading of a, a potentially a monitor on the cooler is giving a bad reading to begin with. They've got automatic information that's being dumped into the program already. So um, that saves them a lot of time. So ultimately in the long run, you know, the goal here when this was brought on board was to reduce, was to increase food safety awareness and protection for the brand, but also figure out a way to reduce the time the managers have to do that. And this system solves or answers both or gives, you know, answers both questions for us and, and gives us that benefit. We have 26 stores. It really helps us monitor our food quality um, and, and our food safety. We do that twice a day. We start with the managers doing that and then we teach our hourlies to do it as well. So uh, not only does it help us with our food safety, but it helps us train our staff to our standards of safety and quality. When you're going through and you're doing your uh, your, your, your timing and temping items, um, there's sensitivities on the screen that says the green beans should have uh, pepper flex apparent and some bacon. It, it, it's a training tool as well as to what our standard for the food is. So you're temping it. You want it uh, in in the case of uh, bacon. You know you want our, our uh, green beans and bacon. You want it to 165 degrees. But um, it also has the sensitivity of the food. What we want the product to look and taste like as well. So it, it's a huge training tool. Yeah, we've got to make sure that we are serving quality food, you know, safe food, to our customer. Um, we have to give our staffs, our individuals working the store, the right tools to be able to do that. Um, there is an education piece, which is very important, and you can educate and teach so much to these people. Um, but ultimately, in the long run, you have to have some safeguards. You have to have some ability to track what's going on. Um, you know, and given these, given the stores these tools, the compliance made tools, and the different things that are involved in compliance made, give the company as a whole 
that safety that we really need to have that extra layer of protection. Um, so when, you know, so we can um, address issues that potentially can come up, um, we can prevent issues that potentially could come up, um, and then we can really make sure that in the long run, our stores understand the importance of food safety through the use of these tools. The monitoring piece will save you money. Equipment breaks, you'll have breakers trip, um, and you need to know that. So uh, we've had issues where our walk-in coolers went down, we've been able to respond in an hour. Uh, uh, last year it happened overnight, around two in the morning. Managers leave at 12.30, went down at two. We wouldn't have came in until seven o'clock, it would have been over. All that food would have been in the danger zone, but we got a call, I wanna say it's from Chicago. Um, so we got a call from Miguel to say, hey, it's temping at 50 degrees and dropping fast. And I'm like, uh-oh, that doesn't sound good. Got in my car, came out of here, and sure enough, it, it was down. So we got, it, we got a mechanic out right away, got it fixed, saved a lot of food. They usually want 30 days on file of line checks. How do you know your food's safe? What is your system? And then when they see a system like this, they're, they're, they're very happy with it. Between the, 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 uh, the pad where we do our actual check-in and, and, and the monitor system, with the monitors and the coolers, they, they like that a lot. They know we're taking it serious. One thing that Five Guys likes to do is be on the cutting edge of anything and try to be always ahead of the game. And you know, My, my goal is always to be one, uh, one version of the food code ahead of you know, whatever it is. Um, you know, and so when paper logs were introduced and were required, and or, you know, when we talked about paper logs and a lot of health departments said, hey, you got to have some kind of documentation, we were already there. Um, the technology, how, how technology as a whole has advanced, you know, I don't see this, I don't, I don't see, I don't see things taking a backward step in any sort of way. I definitely see, see things taking an advance. I see even these kind of devices being even more advanced as time goes along, um, you know, being able to utilize, you know, you know being able to um, take readings of sanitizer solution and being able to track that information, fry oil temperatures, grill temperature, and being able to capture all that information and boom and have it in some kind of, you know, and, and warehouse it into a, you know, to where, you know, everybody can view it and we can figure out what's going on, um, you know, it's so, it, it, the question is, is, is this, this is the way of the future? Absolutely.